Yo, what's good everyone? My name is Darrell Williams. Welcome to vlog 14. So happy fall and happy turkey day if you're watching this on Thursday. Um, it's cold outside. I should have definitely worn gloves in this vlog. But today I just want to keep it short. Just kind of want to talk about being thankful. And I know what you're thinking. It's 2020, the worst year ever. What possibly is there to be thankful for? And I just want you to bear with me because I'm sure you can find at least two things, if not one, that you can be thankful for this holiday season. So I'm going to tell you a little bit what I'm thankful for. And if you're thankful for something, share it in the comments below. Um, please like this video, subscribe with me a lot to me and the YouTube algorithm. All right, let's go. So like I was saying earlier, I want to kind of talk about just, you know, being thankful and thankfulness and what I'm thankful for in 2020. And I maybe I'm just an over optimistic person. That's why I think there's still a lot to be thankful for. You know, the basics, you know, I have a closing today. I'm very thankful for that because Lord knows I need that money. Um, I'm thankful for the fact that I still have something to do that I'm still working, you know, that I have clients that I'm working with. Um, even during these tumultuous and uncertain times that you know I was able to submit some offers yesterday and that's just on the business side but what I can really be thankful this year in 2020 is that I got married this year in the middle of a pandemic see right here this picture this is my beautiful wife we got married in April of this year so when I look back on 2020 despite all the BS that's happened I can be like this is the year that I married to my best friend lifelong partner and that's something we definitely be grateful for so I'm thankful for my wife I'm thankful for um, the firm that I'm with, Bizarro Agency, and all the agents there. Everyone is cool, everyone's down to earth, everyone has a good heart. So I'm thankful for that. I'm thankful for New York City being resilient through all of this, through the pandemic, through the rioting, the protesting, the looting, and all that crazy stuff that I don't need to get into. You can just watch the news to find out what I'm talking about. But I'm grateful for the city that never sleeps is bouncing back, that's resilient. And you know, people say New York City is dead. Um, I did a vlog on that um, a few weeks ago. You should check that out. Um, you know, a lot of New Yorkers still believe New York is alive and well, and I'm thankful for that spirit because it makes me want to stay here. It makes me want to continue to grind and continue to push forward. And you know, a year or two years from now, we'll look back and like, whoa, we can't believe that happened in 2020. Um, you know, I'm grateful for my family, for my brothers, for my homies that are still here in New York City, and even my family that's not here, that they're alive, they're well. And though this Thanksgiving is certainly gonna look different than Thanksgiving last year, I'm so grateful that I have them and if I can't be in the same room with them for this Thanksgiving because of all what's going on. So yeah, I think you can find something to be thankful for this season. Um, if you're watching this video and you think it sucks, at least you can be thankful that you're alive and you can see it, you can watch this video and listen to it to tell me that it sucks. Um, but if you think it sucks, don't leave any comments below. You gotta hurt my feelings. But you can be thankful for that, just being alive, just waking up, having a roof over your head is something to be thankful for. I know people only think about the glamorous things or you got the new job or the promotion or you made some money and these are the things you need to be thankful for, but it honestly comes down to the basics. And that's what, kind of what I want to leave you with this holiday season. That's, you know, Thanksgiving is in two days or a day if you're watching this on Wednesday. Thanksgiving is a day from now or tomorrow. I keep messing that up. Thanksgiving is tomorrow <laughs> if you're watching this in real time. Um, if you're staying local with just people that are in your household, if you're traveling, be safe, be smart. Um, and the year is almost over. Let's still make it the best year that we can, at least what's left of it and shoot into 2021 with a lot of energy and being positive, positive that, you know, we're pushing through this whole pandemic thing and it will soon be behind us and we can look to a, a brighter future. So yeah, I, I really don't have anything else to say. I'm not a motivational speaker or anything like that, but just be safe this Thanksgiving holiday, stay healthy, enjoy the loved ones you have around you, be thankful for the loved ones you have around you and happy Thanksgiving. That's it, vlog 14, cut the tape.